Few things to keep in mind about the powers. First, let's talk about transmission. It is transmitted from animals to humans. It can be transmitted either by contaminated food like fruit which is being eaten by a bat which is infected or eating the meat of animal which is infected. And there is evidence of human to human transmission also. Now let's talk about symptoms. The symptoms include fever, sore throat, vomiting, headache and this can be followed by altered consciousness, dizziness, seizures, etc. The symptoms are pretty unspecific and this causes a hindrance to diagnosis. The diagnosis is done by RT-PCR of body fluids and antibody detection using ELISA. Then about the treatment. Currently there are no treatments or vaccines available for Nipah virus. All we can do is symptomatic care when a patient is admitted with Nipah virus. So the best way to prevent a disease which doesn't have a vaccine is by taking extra precautions. Do not consume fruits which you suspect to be eaten by bats. Do not venture in the habitats of bats. And when you are taking care of sick animals, use appropriate precautions, wear gloves, wear masks. And finally, what we have all been doing all these years washing our hands with soap and water or hand rub. I hope we can beat this disease before it spreads to any more people.